Valencia Community College at the Osceola Heritage Park, the Silver Spurs Arena in Kissimmee, Florida, May 7, 2011, celebrating everyone's graduation. Sometimes I want to give up, but my kids helped, kept, kept me moving. represent more than 7,000 graduates from Valencia this year. We're immensely proud of you. That is the second largest graduating class among the more than 1,200 community colleges in America. That's something to be proud of. Do not be scared to have opinions or suggestions or even complaints, even if others disagree. And never apologize for who you are. Your voice deserves to be heard. Graduates, you may now move your tassels from right to left. This is, in a way, a little bit of a bittersweet moment for us because you are the last graduating class of Valencia Community College. Come July, we'll be renamed Valencia College. Not a huge change, I admit. But there's one thing that will never change, and that is we come to work every day in deep admiration and respect for the people we serve. And that's you. And I don't know many professions where you can make that claim. Best wishes and God bless all of you. Being a community college, a lot of us do feel like it's us like looked down upon or our voices not heard on, something like that. So when he said that, actually represented a lot of people's voices that weren't able to say that. So I, I kind of commend him for that and taking a pulpit and saying what he did for it and actually just having a voice, like he said, for those who didn't really have one. I'm proud of my daughter, very proud of her. <laughs> we made it. We have actually got a future now. At least that's the way I feel. going places so that's kind of cool and I liked how they presented it too how do you get 7,000 students on a bus yeah that is kind of symbolic of, of moving on and getting to that next big location what do you think of that when you see his name on the bus so proud.